Hello YouTube and welcome to Full Dottle, a channel dedicated to tamping topics such as pipes, tobacco, lore, and more. I am your host, the Bearded Briarman, and without further ado, let's get lit. Welcome back everyone, and on this episode of Full Dottle, I'm going to be doing a quick shout out, a VR, to Eric Weaver over at Sea Smoke Pipes. But first, a little housekeeping. I'm smoking my Savinelli 673 KS Rusticated. This is the Tortuga, and in it, I've got some Cornell and Dill Bayou Morning Flake. I've had a few comments on my page that um, said they haven't ever tried the Cornell and B Deal Bayou Morning Flake. This is my absolute favorite tobacco of all time. It is a, I would call it a medium to full bodied uh, vapor. Quite a bit of spiciness from the Perique in it, but the Red Virginia's in this, uh, just delicious. Check it out, there's two different kinds. There's the Bayou Morning and then there's the Bayou Morning Flake. My preference is the Bayou Morning Flake. Just try it out. So, oh, I think it's uh, 37 or 38 years ago, there was a child born. And on the day the child was born, the doctor took the child into his hands, looked at the child's hands and told the mother, I don't want to alarm you, but I am pretty sure this child is going to grow up and make some of the most beautiful pipes known to mankind. That individual was Eric Weaver. On a serious note, Eric Weaver over at Sea Smoke Pipes makes some of the most amazing pipes I have ever seen. He's got some great handcrafted pipes. They're all, not all of them, but most of them are artisan freestyle. He does do a few classic shapes. I believe he said that he might do a few more in the future, but he has a lot more fun doing the freehand pipes. Gives him a lot more um, space and availability to um, express his own artistic style. I'll leave some pictures up for you here in just a little bit so that you can look at some of his work. Highly encourage you to go check out his work. I'll also leave a link to his page down in the bucket so that you can visit his channel directly and subscribe to him. He has some amazing work out there and in the future, I guarantee you only more will come. Hope everybody is doing well out there. My town just recently um, highly encouraged businesses to start wearing face masks or requiring them in their business. I'm one of those. I absolutely do not support uh, the requirement for face masks in public. However, I do um, respect and support the rights of the individual business owners to implement their own policy and enforce them as they see fit. So I'm a mixed bag. It doesn't bother me to wear a mask, I don't guess. Um, it's not really that big of a deal when I go into a business. I'll respect their wishes. But that's what's going on in my town. Walmart, I think, just made a, uh, an announcement that they were going to require masks in their stores. So I bought my mask as well as one for my daughter, except I bought the, uh, I think they're called neck gaiters. So I bought one for her uh, in a child size and then I bought one for me and then that way we'll have one. It doesn't have to go around our ears, which I, I don't, that would bother me. So I bought one that I can just pull up around my face. But at any rate, I hope everybody is doing well. 
uh, go check out Sea Smoke Pipes. I'll leave a link down in the bucket as I said. Check him out, see what he's got to offer, and when you're ready to order your next pipe, order it from Eric Weaver over at Sea Smoke Pipes. That's going to do it today for this episode of Full Doddle. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to leave me a like and comment down in the comments section. And until the next time we see each other, I bid you farewell and happy piping. Bye, everyone. Don't forget to enlist in the Full Doddle Platoon. It's easy. Just click the subscribe button. Also, hit the bell icon to be notified as soon as I upload the next episode.